If you are looking to factory set your Amazon Echo devices, then look no further, because that is what we're gonna be covering in this video today. So we've got the Echo Dot fourth gen, third gen, and second generation, and I'll be showing you how to reset all of these, so stay tuned. Hey everybody, welcome back to another video. So whether you are just getting rid of your Echo Dots, you want to repurpose them, you want to give them away, or maybe you're trading them in to upgrade to another device, which by the way, I would recommend instead of maybe giving these away, realize that you can actually get some value out of these if you trade it into the Amazon website to pick up the newest version. But with that said, how to restart these. If you've got the fourth gen or the third gen, all you are going to do is hold down the action button. So out of the buttons on the top here, we've got volume up, volume down, we have got the mic mute, and then the last one, one that's just a single dot, is the action button. So all you need to do is hold that one down for 25 seconds. I'll actually do it on this guy right here and show you. So holding this down is going to bring up a yellow light. Now in setup mode. It's gonna tell you it is now in setup mode, but don't be fooled, keep Please holding it down. This will take about a minute. I'll let you know when it's done. Perfect. So first it said it went into setup mode. We want to skip that. So we're gonna keep holding it down and then it finally said it is now resetting the device. It's gonna be about a minute for it to fully finish. Now we see that it's pulsing yellow. Once you hear that it is resetting the device, you can go ahead and let go of the button. Now it takes about a minute to do that. If you've got the second generation, what you're gonna do is you're gonna hold down the volume down and the mute button. So you're gonna hold both of those buttons down for 20 seconds. You're gonna see roughly the same thing. It's gonna flash yellow on the top. You're just gonna go ahead and wait and hold those down for it to reset. Now, once everything resets, just in case you want to check your app to make sure it is gone. So I'm gonna load up my app right here. And if I click up at the first tab up here for Echoes and Alexas, it's gonna list everything that I have. So this very first one that you see here is the one that I am resetting right now. What I'd recommend is that after you reset it, go in here and check to make sure it is gone. If it is not gone, you can always tap on the device. Oh, which is saying it's offline, so that is a good sign. But up in the very top corner here where the gear icon is, top right corner, I'm gonna tap on that scroll all the way to the very bottom, and then the second to last one says registered to. I can just go ahead and click deregister and it'll go ahead and remove it out of my app. So I recommend you doing that if you are getting rid of this, giving it away, whatever, once you've done the factory reset and if it is still in your app. Go ahead and do that, deregister it from your account. So, Hello, your device is ready for setup. Just follow the instructions in your Alexa app. Okay, so you heard that it is now in setup mode and ready to set up. So you are good to go, you are factory resetted. You can go ahead and give these away, re-register them back to yourself if you wanna do that, but that is how you are going to factory reset these devices. If this video is helpful, give it a thumbs up. Let me know that you liked it. As always, don't forget to subscribe for more content like this, and I'll see you in the next video.